Hey, y'all. Okay. Look how she red. Everybody thought we don't tell they doing until I say green. Green light. Green light that shit. Green light. Green light that shit. Green light. Green light that shit. Green light. So this is my first YouTube video. My first official YouTube video. And um, let me introduce myself a little bit. My name is India Nicole. I'm 18 years old. I'm a Christian. I love to cook. I love to eat. I love to uh, go outside. Heavy when I love to eat. I love to do my hair, my makeup. And yeah. Um, yeah. I don't really know what to say because it's my first YouTube video. Anyways, so today's video. Oh, let me just say this. Like, comment, and subscribe, please. Um like comment and subscribe to my channel for more of me if you don't know me you're gonna get to know me i'm pretty little pretty cool i'm freaking awesome period and so i'm gonna be doing a lot of a lot of content a lot of vlogs pranks mukbangs story times get ready with me stay in my life uh do hair with me all kinds of stuff because that's just who i am that's just what i do so today um we're gonna be doing a mukbang plus story time um, I have some chicken wings and fries that I cook myself because I'm her and I can cook. I throw those down. Um, but before we dig in and before we get into the story time, let's say grace because I don't even play like that. You hear me? Lord, please bless this food and nurse to sustain our body, Lord God. Please bless the hands to prepare this food and in Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Amen. All right, let's get into it. Let me just show you my food one more time. I got some ketchup on the side, which has some ranch, but I ain't gotten in. These what the wings looking like. I'm go ahead and get you a bite. Okay, you took too long. I'm hungry. Okay, so there will be smacking in this video. I will be chewing my mouth open. If you don't like it, you can click watch. You don't gotta watch it. It's just what I'm doing. It's a mukbang. What you expect? Okay, so. Mm. The story time I'm doing today is going to be <laughs> how I got jumped by two boys. I'm going to get comfy, y'all. It's just going to get good. And I got some water in this cup. Some cold water. So good, oh my gosh. Or right. story time on how I got jumped by two boys. Um, Not to offend anyone, but these were not boys of color. Um... So let's get into it. Okay, so this was maybe six, seven years ago, eight years ago maybe, when I was still staying with my mother. And um, it was these kids I used to hang out with that I was older than me. I was like 11, 12. So I was older than me. But I used to hang with them. They used to skateboard and walk on the beach and Go to the arcade and the park. And I just used to hang with the older kids. Because that's just my crowd. That's who I hung with. So. It was these two boys. I'm not going to say their name of course. That weren't of color. Um, and. They were in a group that I was hanging with. I was walking to the park I believe. No, mm mm. We was walking back to my house from the park. Everybody used to chill at my house. So, we was walking back to my house from the park, and one of them was playing and threw a rock at me. I don't play like that. You don't throw no rock at me. Are you crazy? Mm mm. So, he threw a rock at me, and, um,. I threw one back at him. Mind you, when he threw the rock, it put a bruise right here on my chest. And I was just a young little little thing. It bruised up quick, and I didn't like that. So, I threw it back. And he got mad. And I'm not going to say no bad words. Um, This boy walked over to me. I thought I threw the rock back at him. And he's going to slap me. Y'all, he slapped me in my face. I just know you want him. And baby, the way I was raised, number one, you don't put your hand on no female, number one. Number two, 
you're not going to slap me in my face and think I'm not going to get my lick back. Oh, that would have good. You can get another bite if you want it. Took too long. Anyway, so. I did my thing with this one. Um. So, he slapped me in my face. Back then, I had like a little. I don't know what you call them phones now. I think it was a little Samsung phone. I want to say it was a flip phone, but it was a more advanced flip phone. So, make sure I can see my food. I hit him with my phone. I forgot where I hit him. But then when he started swinging, I started swinging. My mama, the way I was read, my mama told me, you know, you go for what you know. Do you hear me? My mama taught me how to fight. I know how to fight. I don't even play like that. I don't play like that at all. You think you about to put your hairs on me because you a dude? What? Excuse my hair, it's a little messed up. But you think you about to get away with that because you a dude? I don't care, baby. You can definitely catch these hands just like one of these females. Don't play with me. So he gets a swing, yo. I get to swing her, and we just get to fighting. Mind you, I was like 11 or 12, and this boy was like 15, 16. And he bigger than me, like height-wise. So, he's not too much taller than me, but he was taller. So, we fighting. My siblings... I happened to run outside and um they jump in because they don't play like that they're my babies they don't even play like that they don't let nobody put their hands on me are you crazy so me and him fight him um i remember i get the scratch of his neck and his back i think i ripped his shirt I think I ripped his shirt, but I'm scratching like, I'm scratching him hard. And I don't know if he's on my power, but I'm not gonna cap, he beat me up. He hit me a few times in my face. Then the rest, he hit me in my back and my chest and my head. I'm trying to block it and swing at the same time. Like, you feel me? But he doing his big one with me. Anyways, so. Um, that's pretty good, y'all. So, we're still fighting. My brothers and sisters jump in. It was just two of them. Right? But before my brothers and sisters jumped in, his older brother that also hung with us, this boy is like 17, 18. He jumped in. So we got two dudes that's not of color jumping me. Little old me, y'all gonna jump me? Really? Are you serious? I'm not, but so big. It takes real y'all for me, little old me. And don't tell me that I'm a female. Y'all dudes, y'all stronger than me. But I'm doing my big one. I'm not fighting fair at all. I'm kicking, biting, scratching. I don't even play like that. Because y'all gonna jump me? So then that's when my brothers and sisters jumped in. And they was little. They jumped in. So we all fight. We out of having a brawl. Finally, one of the dudes that also hung with us, I didn't hang with all boys. There were females there too, but they were just watching. That's why they're not my friends now, because they're not no real friends. Y'all sat there, y'all let me get jumped. Anyways, so, um, they finally broke it up, and we fussing at each other. I'm cussing like a sailor, y'all. So, somebody go get my mama, and my mama asked me, though, know, what happened? So, I'm like, Ma, he threw a rock at me. I threw one back. 
Then he hit me and we got to fight and blah, 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 blah. And I kept going on and on. My mama crazy. Well, my mama was crazy. She's crazy. Y'all crazy, just crazy. That's where I get my crazy from, because she crazy. So, she, she get the going off him, but she ain't put her hands on him or not, because she didn't want to go to jail, because they underage. Mind you, my mama was friends with their mama. <clears throat> so, my mama get me, and these, mind y'all, the whole time, these boys stay next door to me. These boys and their mama stay right next door to us. Like, we got next house over. So, my mama go to their mama house with them and me. And my mama get to cussing her out. You need to get your servants putting their hands on my daughter. Da, 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 da. I'm like, Ma, chill, chill, chill. It's okay, it's okay. She was like, no, nah, look at your lip. Look at your lip. Y'all, they bust my lip. I didn't even know it, y'all. My lip, I don't think it was, I don't know if it was bleeding. It was so long ago, I don't remember. But she was like, look at your lip, look at your lip. So I felt my lip, my lip was swole up. They bust my lip, y'all. I'm going to fight again. I want another round. Remember that. Anyway, my mama's spazzing. Um... Gay mama trying to calm my mama down. My mama not trying to hear none of that. <clears throat> At all. She just mad. She wanted to know what happened to her baby, which I don't blame her. I'll be the same way. Um. Um. My mama wanted to. Originally, my mama wanted to press charges for assault and battery. Because, like, later on that night, my face started getting worse. My eyes started swelling up. My lip was swelling and everything. And it was just getting bad. And you could see, like, that I've been fighting in my face. Like, you could see it. So, my mama wasn't feeling that. She wanted to press charges. But I was like, no, don't press charges. I ain't want to look like a punk, y'all. I ain't going to lie. Even though they drunk me. They could have killed me, no cap. They really could have. I don't know if that was their intentions or what, but when they, was, when they were fighting me, they didn't have much of any mercy. It was like, I I don't know. It was like I did something to them real bad. All, and all it really was, you threw a rock at me, I threw one back. You got mad and you hit me, we got the fighting. You shouldn't have threw one at me if you didn't want one throwing at you. That's just common sense, right? Anyway, so... Um, I didn't want to like a punk, so I told my mama, you know, don't press charges. I don't want you to press charges. Uh, I don't want to, you know, go to court and lock the boys up and all this extra stuff. This is all cool prior to this. Like, before all of that happened, all of that went down, we was all good. Like, I was cool with every, every last one of them. I will call that mama. I used to go over there and play the game. All that. I'm not going to call it. I used to run the streets. Not like that, but I definitely used to run the streets. Um, food almost gone, y'all. been tearing it up. I ain't gonna I've been tearing it up. <clears throat> I'm going to like to play with my food. I have five wings and a lot of fries. Um, so, more of the story, I didn't go through, we didn't go through with pressing any charges. Um, the whole neighborhood knew about it. But, um, everybody was talking. Like, the entire neighborhood knew. And everybody was talking, word got around. Oh, India got jumped, blah, blah, blah. People coming to my house, checking up on me. Everybody texting me, asking me, am I good? Everybody talking it, talking about it at school. Talking about if I was there, I would have helped you. Blah blah blah. I would have jumped in. Hush, cause you wasn't there. Anyway, so fast forward. People just kept talking about it. Uh, the boy. One day I was home. The boy came over to my. Well, both the boys came over to my house and they apologized. And they said we were sorry, blah, 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 whatever, whatever. After that, I don't think we was cool no more. I believe they moved away. 
Because where we stayed, we stayed for a long time. But somebody else moved into that house after. So they moved. My mom was about to beat their mama up, though. I ain't gonna lie. Gonna lie. She was definitely about to get beat down. Even though it wasn't really the mom's fault. I mean, no matter how you raise your children, they're gonna do what they wanna do. You feel what I'm saying? Like, and they wanted to jump me. For whatever reason. Um. That's pretty much it for the story time part. This food is just beef around me. Because I smell sweet. Because that's who I am. You're doing too much. Anyways. So. Oh, what else can we talk about? I'm going to do. I'm not sure what kind of video I want to do next. I know I'm going to do a get ready with me soon. Because I'm going to do an at home photo shoot. So I'm probably going to do a get ready with me for my photo shoot. Or maybe like when I'm doing someone's hair, I record that, how I do that. Maybe a tutorial. Or another mukbang, because I love to eat, baby. One thing you're going to learn about me watching the, watching my channel, I love to eat. Like, food is the key to my heart. And if I don't do nothing else, I'm going to eat good. Every time. I just, it's automatic for me. I just have to, you feel me? Like... I'm a big girl and I love to eat. So, what may I do? I may do uh, come shopping with me. I, I know that I have um, a scene haul, Black Smart Heart, and a Timu haul um, in the works. So, I'm going to film those. Um, but this being my first video and my first time uploading, I don't really have a schedule when I'm going to upload. But, um, I'll plan that soon. Right now, we're kind of just testing the waters. And she has, um, um, what else can we talk about? <clears throat> I have a lot of story times to tell y'all. Like, I have so many stories. Like, I lived, for me to be so young, I lived a long life. Like, I'm only 18, and I'm, like, young, but I still feel like I lived a, a long life, and I got a long life ahead of me. Um, But I have so many story times, so many things that happened to me. I done been through so much. I done dealt with so many things. I done experienced so many things. I done went on so many adventures, and that's why I say I'm freaking awesome, because I am. Like, I'll tell anybody that any day, I'm freaking awesome. You feel what I'm saying? Because I'm her, you feel me? And that's not just to be conceited or cocky. I'm actually her. Like, all the time. But, that was pretty much it. This is pretty much the end of my video. I'm going to finish up my food. But, yeah, y'all. This is the end of this video. Feel my plate looking like definitely bust that down. Um once again, y'all, like, comment, and subscribe, please. If you don't know me, you're gonna get to know me and you're gonna love it here, baby. So stay tuned for the next video. Bye.